Use star code Aquila when buying Robux or Premium. Also check out my Roblox merch and my real life merch. These are all of my social media accounts and I have no backups. And my Discord server will be linked in the description. Subscribe and enjoy the video. Hi everyone, it's Aquila. Welcome or welcome back to my channel. And Bloxburg updated? I'm just kidding, Bloxburg did not update. Sorry for the clickbait. But today, we're going to be talking about Bloxburg concepts. There's no specific theme, but I asked you guys on Twitter what you would like to see in future Bloxburg updates. So these are some photoshopped ideas that I made to represent for you guys. And keep in mind that nothing is confirmed. I don't work for Bloxburg. I don't know if anything will be coming in the future. So just keep that in mind. And with that being said, let's get started. So the first concept is traffic tickets. I was super surprised that a lot of you guys said that. So what if every time you park somewhere illegally for a certain amount of time, you would get a notification saying that you received a parking ticket instead of your car getting towed away like it does now? Or maybe it could be randomized. So sometimes your car gets towed and sometimes you get a parking ticket. Also, I was thinking about what if we had an NPC run up to your vehicle dressed up in a parking enforcement outfit and then you get the notification. Now, I'm not sure if everyone would want to pay a parking ticket fee because not everybody has Bloxburg money like that to just be given out, but maybe something small, I'm not sure. And we could like go to City Hall and pay it there. I mean, this would bring way more realism to the game. So that was the first concept. Let's move on to concept number two. Concept number two is being able to open up windows. In update 0.9.6, we got the ability to open and close shutters. But one thing that everyone has wanted for a while now is to open up windows. I feel like it just makes a lot of sense. Why can't we already open up windows? I'm not sure. Hopefully we can see that in a future update because that would be nice for us role players. Concept number three is buying ingredients. I'm pretty sure I've seen this concept somewhere before. I'll be sure to give credit. But having to go to the grocery store and pick up ingredients in order to prepare meals. Part of me thinks this would be a cool feature, but I'm also kind of lazy. When I play Bloxburg, I never really leave my plot. So having to go to the BFF supermarket just to get some ingredients seems like a bit much. But let me know what you guys think about that one in the comments. Concept number four is a mailman job. It would be so cool if we could receive mail in Bloxburg. Imagine being able to send letters and maybe even packages to other people on the server. But I mean, it would be kind of hard because I'm sure some people would take advantage of that and say not so nice things. But having a mailman job in Bloxburg would be awesome. Imagine having your own mail truck, getting a cool outfit, and being able to go on everyone's plot and deliver things to their mailbox. Concept number five is a toddler and elder morph. This is something I've wanted for a while. We already have babies, kids, teens, and adults, but having more ages would just be more realistic. As you guys probably know, if you've been keeping up with my roleplay series, I have a baby named Livy, and having her age up to a kid just seems too unrealistic. The baby morph only crawls, so maybe if we had a toddler morph, they could kind of like waddle around, and if we had an elder morph, it could be similar to the animation that Grandma Annie in my roleplay series has, or the exact same thing. She just kind of walks hunched over, but we got that animation from the Roblox catalog, so why not have it in game? 
I feel like it makes a lot of sense. The last concept, concept number six, is being able to control the time of day. I cannot stress this enough, but you're already able to control the weather. If you weren't aware of that, I'll demonstrate. You have to be on PC and you click Control Shift X and then you have the console in the top left corner. And if it was raining right now, all you would have to do is type in weather effects space false and then press enter and then the weather effects state has been turned off and if you wanted to turn it back on then you would just type in weather effects space true let's go ahead and close this for now this would be super helpful especially if you're filming a role play i've showed you guys my behind the scenes process before and we spend a lot of time waiting for certain times of day to start recording. So this would just save us a bunch of time. And maybe this could only be an option for your Bloxburg neighborhood or not. I mean, if you turn off weather, it's only gonna turn the weather off for you, not for everybody else. I think that Froggy Hops, who is a Bloxburg developer, watches my videos sometimes so hey froggy if you're watching this video i hope you could take some of these ideas into consideration but those are all of the concepts for today let me know what you guys think about them in the comments and also leave some more ideas i love making these visual concepts for you well i hope you guys all enjoyed watching this video if you did please feel free to leave a big thumbs up and subscribe to my channel down below. Once you are subscribed, click the bell button so you get notified whenever I post a video. And with that being said, I'll see you guys next time. Bye! Just watch me break.